Check, check. Check, check. All right, so on. Um, we have been presented with a, a pretty good deal by your, uh, by your partner. Kalia is, Kalia is trying to convince us to use the power veto and put you guys up because she's convinced she can send you home. And so I know up to this point you really trusted her that she had your back the whole time. She's been throwing you on her bus left and right. So, and she has been working with all those people down there who've, who've told us time and time again, if you guys go up on the block, that you're going home. So, I and Rachel personally both love you way more than we would ever want Kuli in this house. Thank and we, you. And we want to see you in this game. Thank you. But at this point in the game, it, it also is, is a big deal to us, like who's going to do something for us? Like, who can we really, really trust? And, and like, I love you, man. I think, you're, I think you're an amazing person. Like, I know. And I think you are probably one of the most entertaining people in this cast. I know. So it would be a travesty to Big Brother for you to go. But we also need somebody that's going to be on our side and that we're going to be able to trust. Because at this point in the game, you've met, you really have managed to be cool with pretty much everybody in the game, which is a great position to be in. But there comes a time in everybody's Big Brother social game when you have to you have to start being on the side and you have to oh yeah yeah you have to start developing trust because right now like I, I think you're a great person but I do have trust issues with you because I know you're cool with everybody down there too which okay. is great for your game but horrible for mine okay so if we're not putting you up or sending you home like we need like I, I need to know that you're gonna be yeah and good Kalia, to us. like pretty much has like guaranteed the votes so like yeah she's the if one who she's, on, been, she's been pushing us if we use the power you up, veto put you, put you up. up yeah she's been pushing us and so have a lot of other people in the house i know in the back of my mind that she was doing that yeah because i've had in my ear that do you trust her do you trust her? do you trust her and to this point in this game i did yeah but i also knew that my social game will make her intimidated. Yeah. Right. I knew that. I knew that. So I know this week, her, you know. Well, it wasn't just her. It's like we've had other people, even other people who, who have thought it would be a good idea, like, uh, like the Danielles and like, the, uh, like a couple other people. Right, right. You know what I mean? And, right. And we want to make the best move for us. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. In definitely. this game, because we definitely. are, we have a lot of power right now. Right. We have the ability to send somebody home. But again, I don't want to make that mistake, and I don't want to send somebody home who could potentially be working with us. Right. And somebody that we could really trust. Right. And up to this, game, up to this point, you have an amazing social game because you are very likable, and that's you. Right. That's right. not the game. That's you. You're just in here having a good time. Right. You're being yourself. Right. And that's worked very, very, very well for you so far. Right. But to this point, it, the only the only downside of that is nobody really trusts you in this game because they know that you're good with everybody. So why am I going to trust somebody who could easily run to the other side of the house and right. tell somebody over there who's maybe maybe entertaining the idea that he's telling the truth right. because they're cool with him too. You know what I mean? Right. Well, I thought about it, even if it did come to this point, and I thought of it like a business. Yeah. I thought of it. You, Rachel, Jeff, Jordan, and Danielle. Yeah. You all are the corporation. And I know with my social skills that I'm like the executive assistant to all of you guys. Yeah. So executive assistant always knows what's going on. Yeah. You know, knows what will make you guys happy and knows how to treat you guys yeah. well and to be 100% loyal to you all. Yeah. That's what executive assistant do. Now, for the remaining four people yeah. that will be in this game, I can I know for a fact that I can let you guys know. Well, it's like they are they are the important. Well, for instance, Luan, well, you guys are staying up. You're staying up late with with Dominic. You're staying up with Danielle. You're staying up with all those people that stay up late. Mm -hmm. What are they saying down there? What what is I mean? Because I know you're you're there twenty four seven with them. So you're hearing yeah. everything. You, huh? Oh, I was agreeing. Oh, yeah. Oh, but honestly, I haven't even talked game with them yet. Well, they had to at some point said something about 
like either like getting rid of us or or, or uh, backdooring Jeff and Jordan or well, somebody's throwing around something. Well, no, for real. Uh, me and Dominique Ash was like, no. I said, if you go up again, that's I did discuss that with him. Yeah. I want us both to be together, me and Dominique. Yeah. I mean, that's the only thing that I've discussed with as far as staying up. Yeah. That's it. I mean, as far as game with Danielle or with uh, when Cass was here, I didn't just discuss game with really? him at all. Okay. And what so, about um, Kalia? Like, what is she telling you? Because well, Kalia's been talking about a lot something of game, totally different. A lot of game to a lot of people. Yeah. If she's well, not talking game to you, then that, I mean, that means I mean, the game she's been talking to me is like, you know, you know, we've been working well. Yeah. You know, we're, you know, you know, we're doing well. You know, we're communicating every night before we go to bed. I mean, it's been good. Yeah. That's why I said that's why I trust her. Because, I mean, I was like, you know, if you have a problem with me, I said, let me know. Yeah. I said, honestly, let me know. Especially after Keith incident. I was like, let me know. So. But you, you haven't heard anything. I mean, because this, this is where I'm at right now. If we're going to keep somebody in this game, mm -hmm. I, I really, I, I want them to earn their keep. Right. Because we've been fucking fighting nonstop in this game. Oh, getting yeah. all this blood on our hands. So if, you're, if we're keeping somebody in this game to fight with us, yeah. if, you're not, if you're not out there on the battlefield doing battle, then I need you over there doing recon and getting information, finding oh, out what's going on. That would be no problem for me. Well, I know, but, but what, you had to have heard at least one piece of information thus far, something, I anything. Had, I honestly did not hear anything. In response to who's working together or somebody's saying something. Um, I, I, I know Danielle wants us to, to use the power of veto in a particular way mm -hmm. this week, too. So she's been in our ear, and she's been in a lot of people's ears down there. So has she said anything to you? Mm -mm. I don't think I've discussed Danielle. I was like, you know, as my emotions throughout the game. Okay. That's it. I mean, you know, I was like, I would want, you know, to be with you to the end. I've had to discuss that with her. Like, I mean, I want to be with you yeah. as far as with the veterans. Okay. And I call them the VA. Mm -hmm. I said, that's how I want to be with. But as far as game, we haven't discussed game because she, she, she felt like that she wasn't in the game. So I didn't feel like I could come to her and be like, you know, yeah. well, you know, this is how I want to play this. Well, what are, how do you feel about, like, Shelly? Now, Shelly, on the other hand, she came out the gates, mm -hmm. like Kentucky Derby, yeah. after Cassie left. Now, um, in my, in my, I think that she came out because she felt like she didn't have nobody else because yeah. Cassie was gone. Sure. And she was nervous. Yeah. And now, that's the way I felt. Okay. Now, I did tell Clear yesterday that, you know, Shelly came to me and was like, you know, I want to okay. discuss something with you. And I was like... Okay, but it wasn't about game. It was about my career, what right. I do. Yeah. She was like, you know, what do you do? She's like, you have to do so much because you you communicate too well. You're too smart. That was the only thing I discussed with oh, really? Shelly. Okay. But as far as game, I haven't talked game with nobody, but Dominic, and that was because I was like, you on the block. I said, you won the first um, veto. Yeah. You compared it, man. Yeah. I said, in this game, I don't want you. Yeah. And that's the only person I've talked game with. Okay. And then additionally, anything that you, we ever talk about to you? Right. Like, 100% needs to stay in this room. Oh, yeah. Because even if at any point I find that you're talking to telling other people what we're telling you and what we're oh, discussing. Yeah. Oh, definitely. That's going to be that's gonna be a big blow to me. And I'm, oh, yeah. I'm, in any faith that I will have in you will be gone. Because I'm telling you right now. As much as 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 likable as you are, and as much oh, yeah. fun as I have, oh, yeah. when we separate the two in motion and game, oh yeah, for gameplay purposes, oh yeah, I am still very nervous to trust you because you are friends with so many people down there. So and, I and I'm telling you right now that they all feel the same way about you. So that's why they were throwing you under the bus left and right and wanting to get rid of you. And it wasn't just talk this week; it was talk last week too. It was talk the first week. Everybody kept volunteering. Kalia kept volunteering herself. And then those other people down there, like yeah. the Dominics, like the Keys, like right. the Cassies, were all volunteering you two to go up so that they can get rid of you because they all trust Kalia and want to work with Kalia, and they think Luan's just blowing smoke up their ass. Because Kalia's making deals with them. Yeah. And, um, and telling that you are blowing smoke up their ass. Well, that's... So yeah. I'm saying, I'm telling you from okay. our standpoint, okay. not only do we want to trust you, okay. but... You kind of should be trusting us at this point. Yeah. Oh, heck yeah. Because we are the only people who have kept you safe in this game. Because yeah. if at any point these people had power and they didn't want to piss us off or piss off Jeff and Jordan, right. you you guys would be up and you would be gone because they would they would have the votes to keep right. Kalia. Because 
Kalia is trying to work with every single person down there. Yeah, I know. And she's running back and forth. She's making deals. And with she's everyone. making deals left and right, and she's throwing you under the bus of every opportunity she's got. Uh, I, 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 knew, I mean, from I knew that. Like, and if it helps, I heard from her specifically that you swore, or she swore up and down to Shelly that you were the one who voted to keep Portia. Yeah. To keep Portia. Yeah. yeah. So that six four vote. That went the other way. Those two anonymous votes that people have always been wondering about. Right. She swears up and down it's yours. And she swore on her parents and this and that. I see. Yeah. And here's, here's the funny thing is we know it wasn't you. Thank you. Yeah. But that just goes to show that she is going to throw you under the bus at every opportunity. And she was swearing on her parents and swearing on this. And yeah. She's like, who do I need to swear on? I know for... She's like, it was Lawan. It's always been him. And da 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 Yeah. So you're getting backstabbed by those people down there that you trust. And don't think that at the first opportunity that you're going to be, you are the lowest man on their yeah. totem pole. Because they will get rid of you as soon as they get an opportunity. And as soon as they don't want to piss anyone else off in the house, right. you're gone. And right. your partner's going to be the first one to fucking volunteer you to go up on that mm -hmm. block. Right. So I had the back of my mind that she was doing that, but I'm glad that y'all confirmed it for me. Yeah. Because, like I said, I've been loyal to you all for, from day two. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I have. Yeah. And I mean, it, it 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 does blow my mind, but it don't. Yeah. Because I've seen her whisper. Yeah. And I'm not stupid. Yeah. I mean, I see. Mm hmm You know what I mean? Yeah, for sure. And you know, the reason why I stay up late and all that is because all that sleeping and all that stuff. Mm -mm. Yeah. No. So, I mean, yeah, I know. Well, because I, I, what's going to do it for me? What's going to solidify it? us trusting you and mm -hmm. us wanting you in this game right. to move further with us right. is going to be that you are telling us what's correct and you're telling us the truth. I'm when you stay you up late with, with Danielle right. or Dominic or Kalia or any of those people right. and anything gets said about us or... Honey, I will come tell you with a drop of a And man. that's going to be that's going to be what we we need proof. I mean, we just need proof. Uh, that's no problem. You know what I mean? Because yeah. everybody can say that they're on our side, blah, 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 but if right. you haven't won a single competition right. in this game, right. what do I have to go on? Right. right. You're right. You know what I mean? And also, I know for a fact, actions speak loud in words. Yes, absolutely. I do. And like but, I said, and all those people down there that say they're going to keep you safe, we have now been in power for essentially three weeks. Yeah. And you have not gone home. Yeah. And you have not even been on the block. Right. And that's, that's you're pretty much, you're like one of two couples that have not been on this block. Yeah. You know what I mean? So that's a huge deal. And so you, I mean, just gotta remember that you, you can't go off of what people are telling you because everybody will and tell I you. And I know that. I, I mean, I really do. I know that. And always in the back of my mind, I always say. And it's not because of Kalia, because trust us. <laughs> yeah, not because of Kalia. Right. Yeah. Right. You're I not mean. safe because of Kalia. Right. I mean, but just the simple fact that I know. And what I want you to do is, I want you down there listening very carefully, uh, especially to people like Danielle, because we trust Danielle. And we've been uh, together with Danielle. Um, but she's been acting really odd lately. And it makes us a little nervous. Yeah. And she's been she's been pushing for us to do stuff that she wants to do. Which well, I mean, like, I mean, for example, like, I, I knew, especially last night. That's why 